Hi, Grade 3! Welcome to my class. I'm Teacher Maricar of Angeles Elementary School, your math teacher. This time, we will learn a lesson in mathematics. Today, you will learn how to give the place value and value of a digit in 4 to 5 digit numbers. I will be teaching you how to give the place value and value of numbers up to 10,000. To start with our lesson, let's have a quick review. Let's try to find out which digits is found in the hundreds place. 670. Which digit is in the hundreds place? Very good. It's number 6. How about the next number? We have 395. Which digit is in the hundreds place? Very good. It's number 3. How about the next digit? We have 522. Which digit is found in the hundreds place? Good, it's number 5. How about 983? Good, it's number 9. And the last number, we have 722. Which digit is found in the hundreds place? Good, it's number 7. Very good. Numbers are grouped into periods. The place value of a digit is its position in a number. We have ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, and ten thousands. Looking at our example, we have 15,372. Two is found on ones place. Seven is found on tens place. 3 is found on hundreds place, 5 is found on thousands place, and 1 is found on ten thousands. We can get the value of a digit by multiplying the digit to its place value. Looking back at our example, we have 15,372. To get the value of these numbers, we multiply these numbers to their corresponding place value. For example, number 2 is found on 1's place. So if we multiply 2 by 1, we can get 2. 7, when multiplied by 10, is 70. 70 is the value of number 7 in 15,372. Number 3, when multiplied by 100, is a 300. So 300 is the value of 3 in this number. 5 is multiplied by 1,000. Then we get 5,000. So 5,000 is the value of 5 in this number. And 1 is found on 10,000. So if we multiply 1 by 10,000, we can get 10,000. Let us try another example. We have 10,413. Which of these numbers is found on hundreds place? Very good. It's number 4. How about on tens place? It's number 1. How about on ones place? Okay, it's number 3. How about on thousands place? We got 0. And ten thousands place, it's number one. Putting all together the values of each digit will give us the total value of a number. If we put together 5,370 and 2, it will give us a total of 5,372. If we put together 6,200, 90 and 5, it gives us 6,295. If we have 8,330 and 1, it gives
gives us a total of 8,331. This time, let's try to find out the place value of number 1 on the given numbers. What is the place value of 1 in 9,413? Very good. It's tens. How about on 1,239? What is the place value of 1? Very good. It's thousands. How about on 3,901? What is the place value of 1? Very good. It's once. How about on 10,000? Very good. The place value of 1 is 10,000. How about on 1,430? The place value of 1 is thousands. How about 9,410? Okay, the place value of 1 is tens. This time, let's try to find the value of 1 on the given numbers. What is the value of 1 in 10,000? Very good. It's also 10,000. What is the value of 1 in 1,430? Very good. The value is 1,000. How about in 9,410? The value of 1 is 10. How about in 9,413? We have 10. How about 1,239? The value of 1 is 1,000. Lastly, 3,901. The value of 1 is 1. We need to remember that the digits are grouped into periods. The value of the digit of a number depends on its position in the number. That's all for today. I hope you learned something from this video. Thank you for watching.